have marked ASEAN's aviation industry this year. The disappearance of Malaysia Airlines Flight MH370, Malaysia Airlines Flight MH17 being shot down, and now the disappearance of AirAsia's flight QZ8501. The tragedies take place at a time when ASEAN is liberalizing the region's aviation industry with an open sky policy. While analysts are still positive on the industry outlook, the region's airlines will still have to face a third tragedy and an economic slowdown next year. The fuel price is the biggest component uh, for the cost component for the airlines. Uh, so they expect earnings to, to be better. Uh. Let's say you talk about uh, this one, ASEAN Open Sky. They haven't touched yet the technical issue. I think this one also will trigger the cooperation in between the ASEAN members. In the future, they say they want to join search and rescue operations uh, for the aviation incident. Uh. It's, a, it's also a platform for them to discuss whether they, how they're going to coordinate each other in the future. MIDF research analyst Chua Boon Kian also said that the ASEAN Open Sky policy will benefit the local airlines as it will increase flight frequency and open new routes. Zunara Said, The Star Malaysia.